Hi, this video is from interview.com. Interview.com is a job portal. If you're looking for a job, you can log on to interview.com and you can post your resume with us. In this video, I'm going to talk about uh, one of the important jQuery interview question. Explain Ajax J jQuery request method. There is a Ajax method supported in jQuery. What does that exactly means? Before that, I want to just give you definition for AJAX. AJAX stands for Asynchronous JavaScript and XML. Allows for asynchronous communication. Instead of freezing up until the completeness, the browser can communicate with the server and continue as normal. So whenever, uh, say for example, your uh, take example for Facebook. So in the background, it communicates with the server and gets a lot of information, but it does not freeze the the browser at all so it it's like asynchronous communication your browser communicating with the server asynchronously and you can also continue with your normal operation I'm going to explain to you this Ajax API there is a method called Ajax it can it can asynchronously make a call to the server and get the information and this is how the API looks like Ajax is the method name and it has a type these are the options type URL uh, data type success error complete so type you can have post or get there are two types you can mention post or get post is like submitting a form get is like getting some information it's a same lightweight and post is like you are uh, submitting a form uh, some information from the uh, from the client url is like what url you want to invoke in the server that is server handler html what response what type of um, response format you are looking for here in this example I'm giving HTML so HTML response I'm looking for from the server this these three are callback functions so when the when this call whenever you make a request to the server when this call is success that means 200 the server responded with 200 that means it will come to come to the success callback and it will do whatever you want to do you can do here whatever you want to do error if there is any error happened during whenever you call this URL there is an error happened so you can do whatever you want in the error callback function and complete is irrespective of whether success or failure complete is like uh, once the request is completed it will come here you can do your functionality in the complete so this is this is the Ajax API which is used for asynchronous communication between the browser and the server so you don't even know there is there is a communication happen between browser and server it is asynchronous and it's really good hope this video is useful for your jquery ajax interview thank you and all the best for your interview thank you